Hey y'all, so I'm sharing a haul and so a package from Bianca. Bianca is also from the Netherlands, I think. I'm pretty sure. Um, let me check. Um, no, she's from Berlin. Sorry. But, so she's from Europe. Um, I bought a few things from her and she gifted me a few things. Um, more vintage goodies. Um, this is from her. Look how cute this is. It's like a little... Um, nautical set. Sorry, something popped up on the screen. It's a nautical kit. It comes with paper and some tags and some um, die cuts and things. Ribbon, um, some feathers, some stickers. It's all coordinate, so that'll be fun to make a little something. Maybe a little junk journal. And then she gifted some vintage goodies here. And I don't know, oh, it's gonna rip. Oh, pooey. Then there's some extra little like tickets and film things here and stamps and labels um, in here. And then she also gifted me these cute chipboard stickers. Look how cute. And they have some succulents, some cactuses. Really cute. And then these are all the goodies I purchased from her. And I'll leave her stuff down below. So I will take everything out first. So we can go through everything. show you everything. All right. Let me move that box to the side. All right, we're going to move backwards this time. We're going to start smallest to largest. Um, so these are some airmail envelopes. So there's a couple here. So these will be fun for junk journals or just for packaging. And then, um, I forget what this is. I don't know if it's like a piano tape or I, I don't remember, but it's something like that. And it's like a strip and it has numbers. Um, I forget what it's for. Um, but thought that would be fun for layering and stuff and so cute this bag is this bag is so cute and colorful and then these are really cute um I don't know what they're from I think they're maybe maybe cigarette or maybe they're from a book or some kind of like collector thing and they're like little cards but they're really cute I love this one. Um, there's flowers. Just really pretty images. Little platypus. And then these, which she put this in this cute little ghosty bag. Look how cute. Look how cute. She knows I love Halloween. Um, these are some um, tickets. And they're like these neon bright hot pink. And then these are from a game. I just love the images though. And that it's like this nice hot pink. Just really cute. And I think they have questions. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, the video kind of cut off. So, um, 
my alarm went off on my phone. Um, and then there's this, which this is a set of um, like animal cards. Um, there's even a little booklet in here about it, which I can use. But they're all like types of animals, insects. Just thought some of them would be really cool for Halloween. There's a bat, that one was my favorite. So, really fun. And then I picked up this set of vintage cards. This was like, I guess like a weather game or weather, um, something like that. This one's just a random one, but I think it's has to do with weather seasons, things like that. But I just love the colors and the art on them. I thought they would be fun for junk journals and things. Cute little snowman. Super cute. Um, and then we have a couple other goodies in here. So these are more, um, I think these are more travel. Um, I think they're supposed to be labels. So it says like where they're going to. So really cute. So there's those. And then here's some more of those. Um, I picked out the set of the little German paper dolls. Aren't they cute? So pretty. And then these are, I think, letters. But I don't remember. <laughs> or they're like ent journal entries or something like that. 1935. I can't read them, so I wouldn't be able to tell you. And she lists stuff daily and weekly. So, really fun. And then here's some more tickets. These are longer ones, and they're just like this minty turquoisey green. And then this is one of my favorite things, and these are cut out um, images from Alice in Wonderland. Which I am ecstatic about. I just love these. I'm pretty sure these are from the original story. So, absolutely was thrilled about that. Put them in this cute little pocket which i can probably decorate and reuse um and then these three here are colored ephemera packs so like they go around like a color theme so this one is red so they come with little pieces um all different new old I think this is a sticker and then they have some medium ephemera this one is another sticker I think um, and then this one has some stamps and other labels in here I 
little envelope guest check and then they all come with an assortment of paper so you can kind of make a book with just each of these kind of thing and she has them with a doily and they're all just pages and pieces that can be used um, probably to make like a book or just to work on projects it's like a little colored theme project kit or to make a little um, make a little book so there's certain things in here that have like colored hints to match and then some are just vintage ephemera sheets just to be able to, to do a um, to like complete a project with so that's the reds one now I have to try to get it back in here Okay, and then this one is brown, like neutrals. So again, some fun more pieces here. These birds, I'm pretty sure she cut out, yeah. And then these are stickers. Like washi stickers almost. Look how cute. <laughs> These images are just so fun. And then there's like this piece. Butterfly. And then there's the sheets in here. So we have mushrooms. I love these. It's so pretty. Some book pages, we have an envelope, some more ephemera pages, books, ledger paper, really pretty. Um, this is the um, zodiac signs, which I love, it has a cool balloon behind it. Some more paper, like stationary paper and things, music paper, more book paper. Love this one with the birds. So, very fun. Yeah, now I'm gonna just get everything back in there. And then this one is yellow, which yellow is my favorite color. It goes yellows and oranges like yellow orange peach and then it's um hot pink and black are my favorite colors but the number one is the oranges and yellow so look how pretty the birds there's another little like washi sticker these are those little like specimen thing i think frame things i think i'm pretty sure these are stickers too but look how pretty I'm excited to play around with these. Little doily. Here's some more of those little cards that I got uh, before. All right, I'm back again. And then a little envelope. And again, more vintage pieces. Here's some of those cards. Book paper, some more of the some tickets. Before I drop everything. And again, the same thing, just a assortment of vintage pieces. Look how cute. So really fun. And then I'll be right back. So give me a minute. Okay, so we finished off on the yellow one. Sorry, I had to stop. I got a phone call. I'll make sure I merge all the videos. I know I had to stop like two or three times. Now I have to just 
just try to get this in here. And I'll be good to go. It cut off again. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. All right, next thing. Um, Bianca sewed this cute little vellum pocket, which I'm totally gonna reuse. And we have some printed off copies of some vintage photos. Look how pretty she is. And then we have some more tick vintage tickets and then these are certificates of travel there's pink ones and brown ones so super fun and then um i asked her to put this together for me she did a little um cat themed ephemera set so i can make like a little cat journal like a little mini which i'm super gonna so there's some of the German images, look how cute. Look at the cats. Oops, how cute. Um, and there's hints of pink. I think this is what I'm gonna, I'm gonna use this card to make a little book. Look how cute. And then this is a vintage photo of a lady holding a little baby lion cub. Look how cute. Kitty cats. And then there's some cat stationery. So there's an envelope and then there's the stationery sheet too. A guest check. Larger pink doily. And then kitty cat. Book page. Some music paper. Another book page, some ledger paper, and then this is the cat stationery. And then there's this piece of the cat stationery. How sweet is that? So really excited to use that and do something really cute. You know, something simple and but something fun. That's kitty cat themed because she knows I have all my cats. She had a dog one too, but I don't have any dogs. So there's that one. And then there's these here. So 1950. These are sewing and fashion books. Uh, magazines. So the images in these, I love them. Absolutely love them. I can, just really beautiful. Love it. So I'll just flip through. Just some really cute images. Look at the old. I just love it. Look at the dogs in the vintage hats. Not a little lady with her cat. Look how pretty these women were. Gorgeous. Here's another one. There's a couple here. This one's kind of already fell apart a little bit. But again, with the images and stuff, I fell in love with these. Oh, I was ecstatic about these. Then there's this one. And this one. 
Some of them are older. So this one's 1950. This one's 1949, 1951, and 1950. And then this magazine here is a floral one. So it's 1966. This one's all plants. Let me zoom out a little bit. This one's all plants. And gardening. So there's that one. And then this is um, just old um, ledgers. She said ledger, so 1930. No. 1946. 48, yeah, 1944, so it's just a bunch of, it's just an assortment of letter sheets. Um, and then this one is from 1919, and this is a medical magazine, um, or at least a section from a magazine. But um, this has like a lot of um, advertisements and it's like a lot, I think it's all about uh, dental stuff. It's all like dental equipment and things. Dentists, dentists and supplies. There's a dental chair. But they're all in here. So these will be really fun. Um, I know I want to do a couple laboratory. I want to do a laboratory themed book. So this will be fun to use some of this for that. Um, I have some old scripts, prescriptions and lab scripts and things. So, um, definitely something I want to do. So that's everything from Bianca. I do have more coming from her. So, um, but this is first haul from her that I've got and uh, go check her out. I'll put the link to her store down below. Bye guys.